Hi, this is Chris Gould with Geeks On Tour, and this tutorial video is about using Zoom for online meetings. This lesson is your very first Zoom meeting. How do you join it? First of all, what equipment do you need? Your laptop is perfect. It has a camera built in and it has microphone built in. Now, if you're in a noisy environment, you might want to use a headset instead or some earbuds, but today's laptops, the microphone that's built in is pretty good. So to join a Zoom meeting for the very first time, you do not need an account in Zoom. All you need is the meeting ID of the meeting you want to join. Let me show you what I mean. You just go to zoom.us and click join a meeting. Now I was told or I got a text message or something that the meeting ID is and you click join. If this is the very first time you've done this on this computer, you will be asked to download just a tiny little Zoom app. I clicked OK, big orange arrow says click on Zoom, and it installs, very easy. It asks what name I want to appear for, my, for me. I can just type Chris and join meeting. And you get the opportunity to say whether or not you want to join with video. And you also do want to join with computer audio. Hi Jim. Hello. This is the way it opens up f at first, but if I click on gallery view, now it puts us in our own little our own little boxes here. And if you need to sneeze, you might want to mute your audio. You do that by just clicking on the microphone. Now he can't hear me. All right, now show him what it looks like for your side. I can't hear you. Oh, show him what it looks like from your side. Try muting and we'll see the little red microphone. And now we can't hear him. Same thing with the video. But I get a message up there that tells me that I'm muted. It hears that I'm speaking and it tells me that I've muted. It's kind of cool. So to unmute, you just click the microphone again. Click it to mute. And sometimes just pressing the space bar works too. But Thanks. don't expect it to work every time. <laughs> and then the camera, the same thing. You can turn the camera off and then it just goes to your name turn it back on and it comes on. But what if you need to more fine tune? For example, I have two cameras on this computer and it is the webcam that's being active. What if I don't want that? You click on the little arrow instead and switch to the different camera. There, you can see. So same thing with the microphone. I'm using a headset. If I take the headset off, I might want to change it. So these are the things that when you first join a meeting, people might say they can't see you or they can't hear you. These are the things to, to look at. And if you, when you're ready to leave a meeting, you click leave a meeting down in the lower right hand corner. Now there's one other way to get into a meeting. Let's say that you actually were sent a link. And here is a link in an email. So all you have to do then is just click the link. And since I've already downloaded the Zoom app, it just says open Zoom meetings. Join with video. Join with audio. And now I might want to make it full screen as well. Hi, Jim. How are we doing? <laughs> doing good. And just one last thing I want to show you, and that is what if you've moved away? You, you, you decided you needed to check your email for some reason. So you go over and you're looking at your email. Now how do you get back to your Zoom meeting? You might be surprised to see it's not up on your browser tabs at all. That's because it's an app. It's down here on your taskbar. You click that 
and now we're back. Okay, thanks for playing. <laughs> and I'm going to leave meeting. Oh, stop it. <laughs> <laughs>